Various institutions across the country were established to carry out advanced research and development in information technologies under specific areas. In this category, the IIITs continue to attract a huge crowd of students interested to pursue a technology-driven career. Welcome to College Suggest. In this video, we are comparing the International Institute of Information Technology, Hyderabad, with the Indra Prastha Institute of Information Technology, Delhi, and International Institute of Information Technology, Bangalore. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite college details, college comparisons, courses, careers, and so much more. As always, we will only consider the facts that are submitted by the college to the NIRF for the 2019 ranking until the 2020 NIRF data is officially out. We'll leave the link in the description below. Triple IT Hyderabad is the oldest among the three as it was established in 1998. Following it, Triple IT Bangalore was established in 1999, while Triple IT Delhi was established in 2008. All three institutions were established with the aim to encourage innovation and entrepreneurship in specified domain areas of information technology. Let's have a look at the NIRF scores of these institutions under different parameters and understand where they have given their best. Under Teaching, Learning and Resources, Triple IT Delhi has scored 56.55%. Following it, Triple IT Bangalore has scored 54.82%, while Triple IT Hyderabad has scored 53.07%. Under Research and Professional Practices, Triple IT Hyderabad takes the lead with 34.19%, while Triple IT Delhi follows it with a score of 24.08%, and Triple IT Bangalore has scored 14.27%. In Graduation Outcomes, again, Triple IT Hyderabad dominates with a score of 73.41%, while Triple IT Delhi has scored 69.37%, and Triple IT Bangalore has scored 61.96%. Triple IT Bangalore has performed better in outreach and inclusivity with a score of 55.76%. Triple IT Hyderabad has a score of 52.5% and Triple IT Delhi has scored 41.5% in this parameter. Under Public Perception, Triple IT Hyderabad has scored 26.21%, Triple IT Bangalore has scored 18.19% and Triple IT Delhi has scored 12.76%. Comprising all of these, Triple IT Hyderabad has an overall NIRF score of 48.73%, while Triple IT Delhi has a score of 43.49%, and Triple IT Bangalore has a score of 40.51%. When it comes to the NIRF ranking, Triple IT Hyderabad takes the lead, though it has dropped to the 39th rank. On the other hand, Triple IT Delhi has moved up to the 55th rank, and Triple IT Bangalore has dropped to the 65th rank. Triple IT Hyderabad is located in Gajji Bauli, Hyderabad. The nearest railway station to the institution is the Hyderabad Deccan Station, which is 16.5 kilometers away. While the nearest airport is the Rajiv Gandhi International Airport at 30 kilometers from the institution. Triple IT Delhi is located in Okla Industrial Estate, New Delhi. The nearest railway station is the New Delhi Railway Station, which is 15 kilometers away from the institution. The nearest airport is the Indira Gandhi International Airport, which is 17.5 kilometers away. Triple IT Bangalore is located in Electronic City, Bengaluru. The nearest railway station to the institution is Krantivara Sangoli Rayana Station, which is 21.2 kilometers away. And the nearest airport with international connectivity is the Kempe Gowda International Airport, which is 52.4 kilometers away. Among the three, Triple IT Hyderabad has a bigger campus of 66 acres. Following this, Triple IT Delhi has 25 acres and Triple IT Bangalore has 9 acres of campus area. All these institutions are well maintained and have various facilities that are ideal for a fun learning environment. Some of the common facilities available are Wi Fi enabled campuses, lecture halls, auditoriums, ATM machines, stationery shops, high tech labs, and various others. Undoubtedly, the library serves as an integral part of any institution, and all these institutes are equipped with the finest libraries to meet the needs of the students and the faculty members. Triple IT Hyderabad boasts of having the highest collection of books among the three with a count of over 50,000 books. Following it is Triple IT Bangalore, which has over 34,000 books, and Triple IT Delhi, which has more than 8,000 books. 
apart from these collections, the libraries also consist of various e-journals, newspapers, project papers, theses and subscriptions to various magazines. All three institutions have separate hostels for boys and girls. The hostels are self-contained and consist of all the amenities needed for a daily routine. A healthy mind is the result of a healthy body and all three institutions have excellent sports facilities for various games. The students are encouraged to take part in various sports meets held in and around the institutions. Some of the common sports facilities available are cricket grounds, football grounds and courts for volleyball, basketball, table tennis and several other games. For admissions into IIIT Hyderabad for the UG four-year program, the candidates must clear UGEE, that is the UG Entrance Exam or JEE Main. For dual degree programs, the candidates must clear either UGEE or Olympiad or KVPY. And for admissions into PG programs, the students must clear PGEE. To get admissions into IIIT Delhi, UG aspirants must have a valid JEE Main score. For admission into the PG programs, candidates must have cleared GATE. Non-GATE students with CGPA of at least 7 can also apply for PG admissions. IIIT Bangalore admits students into PG integrated courses through JEE main scores and PG two-year admissions are made through GATE scores. IIIT Hyderabad offers two UG, eight dual degree and four PG programs. IIIT Delhi offers seven UG and nine PG engineering programs. Unlike the other two institutions, IIIT Bangalore does not offer a regular UG four-year program. Instead, it offers two PG integrated and four PG courses. IIIT Delhi has an approved intake of 382 UG seats. IIIT Hyderabad intakes 150 UG students and 170 dual degree students, while IIIT Bangalore intakes 120 students to its PG integrated program, in which students who completed their class 12 are admitted to pursue a master's degree. IIIT Bangalore intakes a high number of PG students with 210 seats. Following it, IIIT Delhi has 164 seats and IIIT Hyderabad has 130 seats. When it comes to the total number of students, IIIT Hyderabad takes a lead with their 1,374 students. IIIT Delhi has 1,188 students and IIIT Bangalore houses 769 students in the engineering streams. 80.06% of the students studying in IIIT Hyderabad are boys and 19.94% are girls. Among the students studying in IIIT Delhi, 78.12% are boys and 21.88% are girls. In IIIT Bangalore, there are 77.77% of boys and 22.23% of girls. IIIT Hyderabad has 1,026 students from other parts of the country, 239 students from Telangana and 109 students from abroad. IIIT Delhi has 681 students from within the state, 442 students from other parts of the country and 65 students from abroad. IIIT Bangalore has 63 students from Karnataka, 700 students from other parts of the country and 6 students from abroad. IIIT Delhi has 135 full-time PhD students. IIIT Hyderabad has 120 full-time PhD students and 59 part-time PhD students. And IIIT Bangalore has 33 full-time and 40 part-time PhD students. Last year, IIIT Delhi had 6 full-time students graduate with a PhD. From IIIT Hyderabad, 9 full-time and 3 part-time scholars graduated with a PhD. And from IIIT Bangalore, 2 full-time and 5 part-time students graduated with a doctorate. Moving to graduation stats, IIIT Bangalore shines bright with their PG integrated graduation rising to 98.24%. Following it, IIIT Delhi has shown an improvement of 91.08% while IIIT Hyderabad consistently maintains its graduation at 88.14%. Among the graduates, 12.5% of the students from IIIT Bangalore have opted to go on for higher studies. 16.08% of students from IIIT Delhi have decided to go for higher education and 10.08% of students from IIIT Hyderabad have decided to study further. When it comes to PG graduation, IIIT Bangalore dominates again with an improved percentage of a perfect 100%. 
Triple ID Delhi comes next with an improved 96.33% and Triple ID Hyderabad shows a dropped PG graduation of 94.82%. The dual degree graduation of Triple IT Hyderabad has drastically dropped to 42.1% and needs more improvement. 0.55% of the students from Triple IT Bangalore have opted for higher education, while 4.76% of the students from Triple IT Delhi have decided to study further. None of the PG students from Triple IT Hyderabad have chosen to study further. 5.35% of the dual degree students from Triple IT Hyderabad have opted to go for higher education. Both UG and PG placements at all the institutions have made an extraordinary performance. Triple IT Hyderabad maintains its UG placements at a perfect 100%. Triple IT Delhi also maintains its placement at 100%. And Triple IT Bangalore's PG integrated placements have moved up to a perfect 100%. The number of students placed from Triple IT Delhi is more with a count of 120 students. The number of students who got placed from Triple IT Hyderabad is 107 and from Triple IT Bangalore, 49 PG integrated students were placed. Triple IT Bangalore excels in PG placements by placing 100% of the PG students and Triple IT Hyderabad follows it with an improved percentage of 97.27%. Triple IT Delhi's PG placement has moved down to 96%. Triple IT Hyderabad dual degree placement is maintained at 100%. Triple IT Bangalore has placed more PG students with a count of 180, while Triple IT Hyderabad has placed 107 students and Triple IT Delhi has placed 96 students. 53 dual degree students were placed from Triple IT Hyderabad. Placed students from all three institutions are offered a very good salary package. The median salary package of UG students from Triple IT Hyderabad has improved to 22 lakhs per annum while Triple IT Bangalore's PG integrated median salary package has slightly dropped to 13 lakhs per annum. Triple IT Delhi's UG students were offered 12 lakhs per annum as a median salary package. PG students from Triple IT Hyderabad have received a better salary among the three with 16.25 lakhs per annum. A median salary package of 13 lakhs per annum was offered to the students from Triple IT Bangalore and Triple IT Delhi has received 12.5 lakhs as a median salary. The placed dual degree graduates from Triple IT Hyderabad received 22.25 lakhs as a median salary package. Most of the IT sector industries prefer to hire students from these prominent institutions. Some of the recruiters who hire students from these institutions are Google, Amazon, Dell, IBM, Infosys, HP, Cognizant, Oracle, Microsoft, Accenture, and many others. The complete list of companies that recruit from the individual institutions is given in the description box below. Triple IT Hyderabad has 94 faculty members and among them 92.55% hold a doctorate. With this, the institute has one faculty member for every 15 students. Triple IT Delhi has 79 faculty members out of which 93.67% hold a doctorate and the institution has one faculty member for every 15 students. Triple IT Bangalore has 65 faculty members and among them 75.38% hold a doctorate. This makes it one faculty member for every 12 students. These Triple ITs have specialized labs for research and development programs. This helps them to reach for new frontiers in IT-related research programs. In recent years, Triple IT Hyderabad has published five patents, Triple IT Bangalore has published three patents, and Triple IT Delhi has published one patent. Two patents from Triple IT Hyderabad have been granted in the past year, while one patent from the other two institutions was also granted. Triple IT Bangalore has received over 12 crores as sponsored research funding, while Triple IT Hyderabad has received 11 crores as sponsored research funds. Following both, Triple IT Delhi has received over 3 crores as sponsored research funds. As consultancy project funds, Triple IT Hyderabad has received over 72 lakh. Triple IT Delhi has received over 67 lakh and Triple IT Bangalore has received over 57 lakh. Triple IT Hyderabad has spent over 13 crores as annual capital expenditure in which 62.03% was utilized on purchasing new lab equipment. More than 45 crores was spent as operational expenditure and a huge part of this was spent on the salaries of the staff. 
Triple IT Delhi spent over 61 crores as capital expenditure, out of which 90.44% was spent on the creation of capital assets. The operation expenditure spent was 95 crores, out of which 75.08% was spent on the maintenance of academic infrastructure. As capital expenditure, Triple IT Bangalore has spent over 4 crores, out of which 84.54% was spent on the creation of capital assets. The operational expenditure was 27 crores, out of which 68.7% was spent on the salaries of faculty members. Along with education, all three institutions organize renowned cultural events that attract a huge student crowd. Felicity is the annual technical and cultural fest of Triple IT Hyderabad. It includes technical, cultural and literary events. Odissi is the annual cultural festival of Triple IT Delhi. In 2020, it was organized on January 17th and extended for two days. Infinite is the Technocultural Fest of Triple IT Bangalore. It has over 15 live events, various workshops, and a multitude of online events and contests. Students from all over the country take part in these events and showcase their talents. Apart from these cultural events, all three institutions organize numerous seminars and workshops to enhance the minds of their students with current trends in information and technology. So we have covered all the important parameters of these reputed institutions of information technology. Each institution has performed at its best in certain areas while all of them have their ups and downs. The facts clearly show that Triple IT Bangalore's excellence is in graduation outcomes, while all three institutions have perfect UG placements. When it comes to overall performance, Triple IT Hyderabad takes the crown with its outstanding curriculum while the other two institutions also have proven themselves to be sought-after destinations for advanced education in information and technology. What other interesting comparisons would you like to see? Let us know in the comments section below. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and for more information, visit collegesuggest.com.